What's up guys, Steve Guitar 741 here. I'm just about to shoot my video for uh, Gangster's Paradise, but I just wanted to show you guys this really cool drum machine. Um, this, believe it or not, was the original, I guess technically original out of time drummer, this drum machine here. Um, this we used way back in 2016 when it was just me and Dominic. Uh, but yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this. This is a really, really cool drum machine. I think it's from the 1990s. I'm borrowing this from Dominic right now. I'm going to give it back to him soon. But it's a Yamaha Digital Drum DD5. Um, some drum sounds on it are good. Like, I really like the snare. And some other things are pretty crap. Like, looks, listen to this kick and snare. I actually like the way it sounds. I would be able to connect it to a nicer speaker. The only thing is I don't have any like the inputs to do that, but I plan on buying one of these at one point and you know experimenting more with it. And in the meantime, it just comes out of the speaker. So this is what the kick sounds like. I actually think that sounds decent. I really, really like the snare. Nice and solid. Um, here's the hi hat. I don't like the hi-hat sound, and here's the cymbal sound, which I also don't like. Ew. It's gross. Um, but yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, what you could do here is you could hit pad assign. So hold that, and you could switch around the instruments. So if I do this, and then go... Uh-oh. Trying to do it all with one hand. But yeah, basically, you would hold that pad assign button, and then you could switch it, and there's like a loop up here that shows you. So if I hit, so I, I was on the, uh, where's the crash? Where was it the ride symbol? Now it's just being stupid. I think it's the ride symbol, so we went to conga, hi-hat open, hi-hat closed, rim shot, cowbell, hand clasp, bass drum, snare drum, tom one, tom two, tom three, all the way back. It's pretty cool. It also comes with a couple of presets here. Some of them I do like, some of them not really. Um, I know we, me and Dio used to uh, jam on these, but you would hit start, and we could hit the first one, see how that goes. So it's start here. Like, I like this one. Actually, if you listen to that time, the first album, Fish Mouse, this beat's on there. But yeah, you can shuffle it up a bit. Yeah, so you can just play around with that. And obviously, here's all the genres right here. But yeah, this is a really, really cool instrument. I would totally recommend looking into it for creating like simple beats and whatnot. Be like your own personal drummer. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this really cool piece of history right here from uh, one of my bands. Uh, if you like this video, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.